Lisa Jo, your essential oil girl. We're having a really spectacular sunset. And I just, you really can't see it as pretty as it is. <sighs> anyway, how y'all doing? Happy Friday. Happy Friday. Um, we're all packed. Yep, we're going to go on our, uh, that their cruise that we actually paid for pre-pandemic. Yep, and um, they canceled it, then they canceled it again, and then they, I think this is the fourth, fourth launch date we've had for, for our cruise, so... And it looks like we're going to make it this time. So, yay! We're pretty excited about it. John's been working his low hoodie off because he's going to be out of work for two weeks and, and he can't stand to be out of work. So, he's uh, kicking my vacuum's loose. Can y'all hear it? It doesn't sound very good, but it's coming. <laughs> I figured I'd better vacuum before I go. So, when if I get back, it won't be so thick. Anyway, so. We went to Georgia this week. Yep, we got to go see the babies. Um, that's always fun. I posted some pictures of uh, Donovan's kids. And and I remembered that I didn't take a picture of Lucy, a Brady's daughter, after I was already in bed. So And then she had to get up and go to school. So I didn't see her again. So sorry about that. But she's getting big. She's getting big. She's going to be nine in May. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. But um, they're pretty happy in their new little house. So, yay. Anyway, I'm really wanting y'all to see the colors. It's, it's so vivid, but it just doesn't show up. That's okay. Y'all get the gist. Y'all get the gist. I should go get a camera and take a picture real quick so you can see the difference whenever I actually, um, whatever. Yeah, whatever. All right, so cruise. So we're going on this here cruise. Um, we're, we're, we're not leaving from Cape Canaveral. We gotta go down to, uh, Miami, I think. Um, so we'll be driving down to get on the ship tomorrow. I did have to go take one of them there uh, COVID test. They have, whenever I got there, uh, we had made an appointment last week because, you know, you have to, whatever. And whenever I got there, the girl said, oh, I don't even know if I have any COVID tests. Let me go. I was like, that, that would be inconvenient. Because nobody's doing them anymore. Because they're basically, and the girl doing the blood work says, they're basically obsolete. Yes, people have COVID, but they don't have this strain of COVID. You know, that type thing. So, but I had to pay 90 bucks for them to tell me I don't have COVID. It's just, the whole thing was just, it just not made me happy, girl. And I called the cruise line because I thought, surely John's just doing that because he's being paranoid. But nope. Called the cruise line. They said, yeah, you need to get it. And I bet you $5 they don't check. I bet you $5. So it'll cost me $85. Because 80 for the whatever. Y'all. Y'all. Anyway. Um, and the only place we're stopping that actually requires it is Columbia. And I don't, we must have some kind of excursion there. I told John I'd just be happy to stay on the boat. But the Norwegian people still said, no, you should, you probably, yeah, you know. I was like, what, y'all going to kick all the people off the ship that don't have a test result before they get to Columbia? What is that? But I'm okay. I'll be okay. It's just like, wow. Just such a racket. Such a racket. Now you can see some pretty colors. Kind of. Um... So, and, and no, I ain't got no virus. Oh, it's shock. Um, but I do got all my oils packed. I got enough for four different applications. I got the inflammation application. I got the neurological. 
application. I've got the infectious disease application, and I've got the hormone application, which is what I'm supposed to be doing for my Hashimoto's, by the way. And we are being very bad at being consistent with that. Then, of course, I've got my oils in case, and I've got my little uh, COVID potion that's like a super duper powerful antibiotic kill anything potion. And I got my On Guard. And of course, you got to have your random oils. You got to have like your oregano. So we got oregano, a rollerball of oregano. Um, and that, that helps with um, viruses. So we'll be putting that on the bottom of our feet just to stay healthy because there is a lot of sickness out there. We just don't want to come home with it. Or end up with it. You know what I mean? I'm not saying we don't ever get sick, but we definitely got tools that'll help. So, yay. I'm so glad about that. Y'all, what you learn about the oils, you're, gonna, you're just going to, like, why didn't anybody ever tell me this stuff before? That's the kind of thing oils are. Because they are, they are just, they, you can, everything. I mean, the only reason I ever go into a drugstore anymore, what did I go into a drugstore for? I went into the drugstore the other day, and I was like, this is weird. I haven't been in the drugstore in four months. I used to I used to be in the drugstore every every week. I mean, me and the clerk were like this. You know, hi. You know, so, um, what was I in there for? Whatever it was. I bought, I bought John a, I bought John a Reese's, Reese's uh, Easter Bunny. Um, his mom used to buy him Reese's every Easter. And so whenever Easter came and went, he said, I didn't get my Reese's for Easter. So I, I found them on sale at the drugstore. So I got, I got that. And I think a chocolate milk. I think I've got me a chocolate milk and that's what I got at the drugstore. So no drugs at the drugstore uh, because I've got the oils. So I don't need to do that anymore. Very rarely do I have to do that. Anyway, so I got all my oils together. I told you before, I counted out my panties. I got two bathing suit tops. I, up, up my bathing suit tops, I got some uh, got bottoms that'll fit because you know I've outgrown everything. I, I've expanded in size in the last six months. And uh, so I think I got everything packed. Yes, Lynn, I got the suntan lotion. Um, and Terry gave me a list of stuff too. Electrical cords. I got those. Okay. If y'all think of anything I might forget and let me know. Okay? Because tonight's the night. Because we're going to get up and head out early in the morning. So. Okay. I'm so excited! And you know, I will be sending you videos of of where we're at just because I'm probably more obnoxious when I'm on vacation than whenever I'm not. So I will I will share my adventure via some videos and um, let y'all back curiously enjoy the cruise with me. Alright. That's the vacuum. Can you hear it? It's really kind of cool. It goes really, really fast and gets everything, and then it goes really, really slow and goes around the corners. It's brilliant. All right, kiddos. Y'all have a lovely, lovely evening. John is actually at a dance tonight. They're playing a gig, and I bailed on him again. I'm such a bad wife, but that's okay. His main thing is just make sure you have everything so I don't have to worry about it tomorrow. So, I'm all, I'm all packed. That's the main thing. Yay! Alright. I'm through rambling. I'm just trying to go and process it in my head. You know how it is before you go on vacation. Cause you're just like, well, did I leave the coffee maker on? Well, don't make coffee. You know, did I leave the iron on? I don't even know where my iron is. Did I leave, you know, did I leave the lights on? Did I turn up the air? So, I'm already going through that list in my head. So, you know, it is what it is. So. Alright, kiddos. I will talk to you probably tomorrow and share my adventures. And, of course, as always, you can just click through. That's fine. Okay. You know, it's fine. Alright. 
Cut this thing. 